Every year it makes me sad. It's dead Christmas season <laughs> in Brooklyn, New York. Dead Christmas trees everywhere. I don't know, man. It just ain't right, right? It's a Christmas tree. It's not just here, too. They're all over the place. Every year, same story. Every year, it's January maybe 5th or 6th right now, 7th, I don't know. And Christmas season is over, so there's no more use for the Christmas tree. Just, people just take it and fling it out the door. Now, this is the park, right? But where did they come from? It's from the buildings across the street. So they take their Christmas tree out, right? And then drag it across the street and throw it out, right? Or they just leave it out in front of the house for the garbage men to come and get it. No, I know, I know. It's That's what you do, right? It's recycling. Right? But it just seems, I don't know, it just seems something sacrilegious or something, something not holy about it. Look. They're like, they're like bodies of Christmas past, you know? It's like corpses. <laughs> Right? That's why I never liked the cr a cut tree. I prefer the either a fake one or or nobody's tree, right? Or just go decorate a tree outside. But you wonder how many little kids played under that tree. Did people pray to it? Did they put religious? Did they put religious artifacts on it. You know, like hanging, you know, Jesus and crosses and right? Because that's what it is, right? Isn't it a religious artifact? Isn't it about the religion, the tree, with the lights, the light of God? Isn't it? I don't know. It just seems like a, like the disposable, even Christmas is disposable, right? The Christmas tree is only good for, we take its life. <laughs> we take its life from it. And then when Christmas is over and our, our little... Our little fantasy is over. The tree is still green. Right? It's still green. Right? I don't know. Something not right about it. I don't know what it is, man. Marcus Conti reporting. <laughs>